Marion County says they're not anti-vax, but they're not going to follow the federal mandate that requires employers for more than 100 workers to be vaccinated or offer weekly testing. Fox 33's Maddie Weir has talked with them today, plus an employment lawyer. You've got to show that it's a, that unvaccinated workers present a grave danger to the workplace. And I think that that might be a hard sell given we're 19 months into this and we employers have done a pretty good job. Employers already making decisions about the potential federal vaccine mandates. The sheriff and judge in Marion County say they will not be enforcing it, saying it's a private matter. Let me be very clear. Um, I'm not an anti-vax. My, my children are vaccinated. Um, it, it's, it's about the federal government overreaching into something that should be a private decision between someone and their family and their health care provider. Now, I'm not a health care provider, so neither, neither is the uh, government. Since President Biden's announcement, one employment lawyer has been flooded with questions and concerns. I've seen so many people email me that say they telework, they never go into the office, and yet they're being in, being forced with the vaccine mandate from their employer. You've got to question the legitimacy or the validity of why an employer would feel the need to impose a vaccine mandate on someone who was working remote. How does that really relate to the workplace? Historically, the Supreme Court has only upheld an OSHA emergency temporary standard one time. Let's see what's in the OSHA standards when they're published and then start to plan if necessary because I think there is going to be a lot of pushback on that law and employers I don't think right now need to be doing anything in response to President Biden's announcement. Maddie Weiris, Fox 33 News. The Bossier City Mayor's Office says they're talking with legal counsel and medical professionals before they make their decision. The City of Shreveport says Mayor Perkins encourages employees to get the vaccine, but at this time there's no mandate in place. And